In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to check the resolution of an image and how to change the resolution of an image. So when you want to check the size of an image, you're going to come up to image in the top bar. And then you're going to come to image size. Once you click on image size, you can see that it'll say how big the image is. Uh, uh, that's the size it would be printed at, but also what is the resolution? And it lists it in pixels per inch, but you can also change it to um, pixels per centimeter. And in some programs, it might go by uh, DPI for dots per inch. Right now it's at 72 pixels per inch, meaning that there's 72 little pixels in every inch uh, of, uh, of our screen or of our design. And that's really good to make this, uh, the design smaller, but it also makes the quality a lot less. So 72 is actually a really good pixel size or pixel ratio to use if you want things to load very quickly, or if you're only gonna look at it very small. So that's why they use it on the internet where things need to be loaded quickly or are just gonna be graphics that, uh, that appear in small areas on your computer screen. When you're making art or when you're considering printing your work, you actually want a higher resolution. That'll make your program run a little bit slower because it's so much bigger um, overall and there's so much information in it. But we can see that overall, this has gotten a lot bigger because there are more pixels in every inch. 300 is a good standard for printing. So I'm gonna press okay. And it'll take a little while, but it'll convert my image to make it at 300 pixels per every inch. And there we go. It's made it a lot larger, so large that we have to zoom out to get back to our original image. And we can see that for the most part, it looks the same, except this time when I zoom in, it takes a while before we start to see the little pixel grid. You can see now, now we can see the pixel grid and that's so close as opposed to Here's our 300 resolution. Here's what it was when it was actually 72. That's a lot smaller. And it looks like it's about the same, but as I start zooming in, you can see the pixel grid coming so uh, becoming more apparent very quickly. So that is how to change the resolution after we've imported our image.